Boys, how you been? Terrible, terrible situation. Find ourselves in an Inwood today. I was hoping I wasn't gonna have to tell you this, but. Oh, what happened? Are you on the cigarettes? No, I apologize. I thought for sure I was gonna come out here and fucking see though there was a hole in the fence and you and all your shit was gone. The whole backside over there is all done. I'm just getting all the highlighted rusted shit. <laughs> right on. Yeah, I thought fuck you'd had enough of the trailer and you'd quit Inwood. I was gonna come out today and the extension cord was gonna be wrapped around the tailgate and <laughs> Oh are you having fun yet? Well, just this whole situation. <laughs> Holy, the fucking paint whittled right off of that one, eh? Good lord. Beauty, check out my box, too. My box. Oh, yeah, it's kind of hard to weld when you, when you don't really know what happened. Yeah, not too bad. Are you putting the mesh up on top here? Up in between the ranch here? Is that what you're doing? Yeah, here and here. Yeah. So there'll be mesh in between there. And then I got a, you know, patch everywhere where you can see through and stuff. It's, you know, not too big of a deal. Kind of boxing some yeah. some holes and shit, you know. Just a pitchy patchy, pitchy patchy. I'm going to uh, um, I'm gonna take these off and then just make a nice patch or make a whole new top or yeah, something. Yeah, I'll have to cut that out. Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, this one ain't a cigarette. Oh, I apologize. I apologize. <coughs> I've only had two cigarettes so far this morning, but five thrown. <laughs> Holy. Good lord. A couple spots. Oh no. Oh no. But anyways, I gotta friggin' uh, order a couple parts for a couple things. Hopefully we can just get them today. And not dick around, but you know, usually things wanna take forever. I ordered some new welding steps and I, I don't even know what all. Uh, couple couple few things that you know it's like oh I need this everything's freaking closed so I got ordered on the Amazomiums and the Amazomiums even the primes take a month. Some stuff comes sooner, but a couple things that I ordered there, you don't even know what it is. It's fucking coming next month with steps and something else there, so it's like, well, hopefully I got enough steps. I mean, I got the MIG welder, we can always, you know, I want to get most of it done with the stick, though, just because I practice with the stick. I mean, it's just a shitty old trailer, right? So it doesn't matter. It's not like it's somebody else's shit that I'm welding for them, and it needs to, you know, not only look copacetic, but perform of the copacetic factor too but figure out what we're gonna get up to and uh and then get up to it oh boy tornadoic activities big time i don't know that i don't want i don't want to i don't want to know it's times like these that i'm kind of glad that i got all kind of shit to do but at the same time it's like holy fuck man I do that to myself, you know. Oh yeah, flat as fuck tire. That's awesome. Anyways, boys, check this little son of a bitch out. Oh, fuck. Press of the button. Check it how fast this thing friggin' heats up. 
Isn't that crazy? 300 degrees. Already ready to sell there. Look at it. That's making me all on the lie factor. Just melting it like freaking three cigarettes, eh? Here comes a little pad, a little stand. Yeah, very mucho. And then to turn it up, you can just like just start turning her up relentless. I don't know how high it goes, but I just keep it at 300 because that is plenty. But yeah, a little 12 volt, 24 volt asshole. Oh, don't grab the hot bit, eh? But uh, yeah, you can run it off different shit too. You know what that's for? I'll have to look in the instructions. It's got some sort of a roach clip with a Y here onto it, and, and another Y here with a with an antler and and no other stovepipe to plug it into. So I don't know what that's about, but yeah, got a little little thing there, little thing, little thing, decent. No off button though, so you gotta just unplug it and you know, whatever, but yeah. I was soldering under the truck's dash with the with the old friggin' war machine friggin' gun there with the elastips trigger and stuff and uh yeah this one no go. Mucho mucho pain in the asshole, so hopefully. Let's see if it'll melt the bigger stuff, huh? Yeah. Plug her in, turn her on. Good lord. Where'd this thing go, eh? Well, turned up to 340 for that one. Friggin' right, eh? Oh, that reeks. Good lord. But yeah, got windy outside, quit. I'd do some editing and shit anyways. So, yeah, got a little bit of the package. Show you a little bit of the package, you really kind. But, but Dickie come in, his face was all black, and he says, uh, he says, we're ready to paint and I need some weed. So hopefully it doesn't, uh, doesn't rain too much over the next little minute and we get some warm weather and we can shoot some paint on there and finish the welding and then, uh, yeah, it'll be just brakes and wiring and friggin' stovepipe mount the friggin' uh, the raccoon friggin' uh, hose and everything and then we cheat, but anyways. Don't let the watches get you.